Hi, my name is Mrs. Beal and I teach ESOL 1, 2, 3, and 4. This is my first year teaching ESOL and I'm learning just as much as my students are. I absolutely love working with my ESOL students. They are eager to learn, they want to learn English, and they just have the best attitudes. They really, really struggle with um, the massive amount of questions on test. They have a very difficult time with that. So I would just ask all of their academic teachers to be cognizant of that when they are giving tests to uh, English language learners that they are learning English in addition to learning academic work. So the academic language is going to be very challenging for them because the English language is challenging for them as well. So as uh, you prepare the test to give to my ELLs, just please remember their English language proficiency levels, and they're all at very different levels. Of course, we do a lot of differentiation and scaffolding to help those students as well. And if you have any ideas or suggestions, I'm very open to those, and my students are very open to learning. They love to learn, they love to be in school, and so anything that we can do to create a positive learning environment for them would be absolutely wonderful. My name is Sarah Ibijo and I'm a senior. And I'm Elizabeth and I'm a senior as well. Well, I came here like four years ago and I've been having trouble with my first like language because English is not my first language and I would like the teachers to let me use my flashcards or write my test to me or something like that to help me graduate. Mi nombre es Jonathan, uh, soy un senior en Calhoun High School y estoy en clase ESO. Uh, what that meant in English is my name is Jonathan, I'm a senior in Calhoun High School, um, I'm in ESO class. Um, mi nombre es Julissa Matute, es en la, en la Calhoun High School y soy un sophomore. My name is Julissa Matute, I am sophomore, sophomore in Calhoun High School. I am ESOL, so this class is so good for us because we can learn how to speak English very well and how to write and pronunciations or things like that. From another class, um, when we don't know any, something, we can ask Miss Bill and she help us with whatever we, we need. So it's good. Um, in this class, we learn by playing games. We learn um, to write, pronunciate, pronunciate stuff, um, listen in English. Um, every time we, we don't know anything, Miss Bill can help us out in math, English, history, uh, or literature. Hi, my name is Amy. Um, I, because the English is my second language, so right now I was in the ESL class right now. This class is really helpful for us to learn if you are the second language is English because uh, here you can practice a lot of basic English because we, uh, we, are, <laughs> we understand we didn't like the people who are born here, live here a long time, uh, have the good grammar things that uh, here you can practice a lot of grammar, reading, writing, um, the things you are really weak. And if you didn't have the, you have the problem on your academic class, then here is a place to help you. Hola, mi nombre es Jose, soy un junior. My name is Jose, I'm a junior. And I think this class is a very helpful because we are learning a lot how to speak English, and Miss Beer, Miss Beer help us in some other classes. Like I can come here in my classes when I have a test. She help me um, and read, read it to me, and. I can do what other things about other classes. Um, this class is very good for us and um, we're learning a lot. 
Hi, my name is Jesus. I'm a sophomore, and the teachers can help us the best by giving us some more time, and changing the questions, and explaining it to us. My name is Surama Tony, and junior, and is well class. And Miss Bill class well learn a lot, I think, for example, writing, how to read and pronunciation. The best thing my teacher can help me is they for me or my name is Elisa Isep. My name is Elisa Isep. Um, I am junior. Um, she's helping um, test, quiz, whatever. Um, and something um, translate for me and she's very nice.